Vera primarily, who is our kind of the school counselor and the protagonist's friend. And then I also operate as Vera the Beholder, which is a D&D monster. So um, after the cast list went up the next day in the green room, which is our student hangout space, the costume designer turned around and said, so how do you feel about unitards? Sure, let's go for it. On just like a purely plot level, it's about this sister whose family has died in a car crash and she finds out her younger sister has written a D&D &D module and kind of plays through it as a way to get to know her sister and get to know her friends and her world. Um, on a more thematic level, it's kind of a love story. So it's a story about loving your family and loving the things you do fiercely and unapologetically and trying new things to love. For everybody, but especially college students, it's a time where you're figuring out who you are and you're figuring out if whether or not who you are is an okay person to be. And I think it's a show that says yes, absolutely, and it's okay to grow, and it's okay to love people who are different than you are, which I think is always an especially an important story. But I think especially right now where we're in a cultural moment that sometimes we're afraid of having conversations or we feel like who we are is not okay culturally, it's an especially important story to be able to go and laugh with people and cry with people and be reminded that the people around you have the same kind of struggles you do. I've played D&D &D on and off since high school, so for about a decade, but a lot of them had never played, so a bunch of us started a D&D &D campaign before the production even started, after we were cast. So we've had a lot of fun together in rehearsals, but we've also had fun outside of rehearsal. There are three performances left, December 5th, 6th, and 7th at 7.30 p.m., and tickets are available at the Murphy Hall box office.